Hey everyone, welcome back. Today, I'm going to be showing you a digital and analog clock which I made, which both have day reset protection. These are able to display up to 16 hours a day and they work during rain, thunderstorms or night too. This was all made possible due to an interesting feature from Carpet Mod which allows comparators to output the time of day by reading a clock in an item frame. I'll cover this mechanic in more detail later on in the video. As seen here, each output from the comparator is directly connected to its respective clock hand on all four faces. This wiring could most definitely be revised and compacted, but I don't mind as I only built this so it could fit inside the clock tower. You can also convert the signals to binary, and then add them together at the back of a 7 segment display. Using a Carnor map, I was able to compact the redstone by quite some margin in comparison to the prototype that I built up during a live stream. Unlike the analog clock, the digital clock tells you if it's AM or PM. When the light is on, it's PM, and when it's switched off, it's AM. This was made using an OR gate and a switch. So how does this cool mechanic work? Well, if you place a clock in an item frame, a comparator is able to get its output. Now unlike the vanilla mechanic, where the comparator measures the rotation of an item in a frame, Carpet Mod makes it so that the comparator reads the time of day, not the rotation. So the comparator output is directly proportional to the number of ticks passed in a single day, with one output lasting 1500 ticks. Now this clock can also be built in vanilla. If you replace the item frame with the daylight sensor, you are still able to get 16 different outputs. But they won't be as accurate as some outputs last longer than others. With some calibration and implementation of technology such as rain detectors, a full vanilla 16 or even 24 hour clock could be made. Now that about wraps it up. If you want to check out these designs in your own world, I'll be posting the download link over on my Discord, and the links to these cool builds as well as Carpet Mod will be in the description down below. Thank you all for watching and have a great day.